What's up everybody, Annoyed here. Just got a box in from Amazon. Gonna do a quick unboxing and first impressions. Got an EDC Essential here. Something to make fire with. Now, I've always carried Bix and Bix are great. I actually put one through a washer today. Still works. And, and they're cheap. You know, you can grab a whole bunch. I think that for EDC, Bic is really ooh, bubble wrap. Bic is maybe one of the best ways to go, really. You can grab a whole bunch of them and just store them with you. But I wanted something a bit more robust. So I did a lot of researching, looked into a lot of different options. I was really interested at first in those forever matches just because they're really cool. And they're the utility is great with them as you can start a spark with them and they hold a whenever you're out of fuel and they hold the fuel in them a lot better than zippos so it's kind of like a zippo but it's got a nice o-ring to retain the fuel but from what i read at least they seem to be more of a novelty fun item it's not gonna be windproof and you know your striker's going to go out at some point your fuel even though they do it does stay in there a little bit longer than maybe a zippo per se you're limited by your fuel so i kept looking and i really fell into the line of sight of the electric arc lighters and there's a quite a few out there but i found one on amazon for get this like it's 15.99 it's on uh, well, normally $19.99, 20% sell $15.99. Then with Honey, I saved even more and got it for like 13 bucks. It's this Blaze 360 Flex. So let's get this open up and I can show you guys the coolness about this thing. Nice little box here. Okay, we got 360 Flex, stretch hose, and waterproof. Now, whenever it says waterproof, I looked it up. It's an IP56 rating, which isn't the best, but 56 is still good. It can re or withstand uh, jets of water from each side of it. So you have an arc flame, a hose, which is the cool part we'll get into. Um, you know, just quick press the switch. There's a locking lid on it. Um, retaining ring hook, LED indicator for the US charging interface, uh, USB charging interface, it is Type-C. Love me some Type-C. Here we are. Take it out of the box here. Of its nice little packaging. All right, where's that USB cord? Tell me it came with one. Oh yeah, before I take it out of its package, we got our USB Type-C cord, which I mean, it's always nice to have another one, but I've got plenty. And it comes with paracord and a survival whistle attached. So that's that's actually really cool. And I will use that to probably carry it on my EDC pouch. But let's move on to the lighter itself. Get it out of its plastic coating here. Okay, right here, it's got the place to hook your carabiner or your paracord and as it says it's locked help with that ip56 rating push this button to you now you pull that down and then push the button okay nice pops open like that then just ooh, i don't know if you guys can see. oh yeah you can see it on there um now this is nice because you can reach it from 360 degrees. A lot of the arc ones, the plasma lighters that I've seen online are retained within two little walls. So it's hard to reach in there and you really have to, anything with a flat surface, you can't really get to in light. There's the USB charge port there. Feels pretty strong and durable. That doesn't feel like bad plastic at all. But one of the coolest parts about this one is that right there. So that really gets it to the next level of being able to reach into things and light up in any situation, make a fire. Oh yeah, I'm pushing the wrong button. 
There we go, yeah. So I guess with a full charge, you get about 300 lights from this. I think it's a great EDC essential. Like I said, I still plan on keeping a whole bunch of little bigs around. They're, they're great. Um, having actual fire can be a lifesaver. But something like this, I mean, no fuel in it. All you gotta do is charge it up. If you have a solar charger, you can keep this thing and it could really get you out of some messy situations. So I'm gonna be carrying this around, be testing it out. I didn't see a drop rating or anything on it. That would be nice to know, but I'm telling you, it feels pretty sturdy. So I bet you it could probably withstand some drops. And I already know, you know, it's windproof. That arc is not going out no matter what, no matter how hard you blow. <laughs> it just makes it stronger, it seems. Um, and it's waterproof. So, yeah, that's my first impressions. The Extremis, let's see, Extremis Blaze 360 Flex Electric electric Lighter. Um, great for grills, great for just getting yourself out of a budge whenever camping, keeping yourself warm, lighting your cigarette, whatever you need fire for. I think that this would be a great addition to anybody's EDC. So, like I said, just a quick unboxing, little review on it. Um, maybe after I've carried it, if there's any problems with it, or if I'm just super smitten with it, I'll do a little bit more of an in-depth review. Just wanted to throw this your throw this your guys' way. Thanks for stopping by. Please, you know, leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe. I really appreciate everybody that comes by and views my video. I hope you guys are having a great Easter and annoyed out.